No, the idea was to win the game. This was clear, and I think uh, when we see the 90 minutes, I think we had the better the chances you know, to win the game. But it was an eagle game, a lot of fight in the middle field uh, with a lot of second balls. And uh, but we need to score earlier the second goal to have more calm in the end of the game. Yeah, he he, he did well in the second half, especially he created in the first half one chance. Uh, he created also in the first half uh, the chance from uh, Prince Ibarra, the corner kick. Also the dribbling when he dribbled inside and then he missed the ball. Was also a good combination. Um, he's doing well. He's training. He's um, he he's still uh, be normal. That's also very important. He knows he's not ready uh, for everything. Yeah, he needs to still improve as a young guy. But he's doing well and um, try to make still small steps up and up. I think uh, how we work, yes, uh, we are doing well from the beginning of the season. Yeah, we was a little bit unlucky, uh, but uh, we don't think now about number position four. We think about this win. We enjoy the game. Uh, we enjoy the three points. That was for us important. And uh, let's enjoy it tonight. And uh, from tomorrow on, we focus on the next game because the next game is coming soon. That means we had now in seven days three games. Uh, I think a big compliment on the team. Also, you saw they're fighting till the end. And it's not easy at all. Yeah, after having uh, 12 uh, days quarantine, and uh, when you see today, uh, one player came out at three o'clock, uh, like uh, Alan, out of the quarantine and stepped inside because we didn't have enough defender in, in the end. Very com big co compliment. I did the mood is very good, of course. When you're winning, uh, you fun, uh, the joy, uh, um, you're getting more and more confidence. But you need to know the next game is coming and uh, respect also the next uh, opponent and to, to know in the next game you need to start again 0-0 zero, zero, yeah, with 100% effort and that is very important. But uh, the, um, especially the time in the bubble right now, when you win it makes it a little bit more easier to enjoy a little bit of time. But um, yeah, we go forward and have fun today. Yeah, but you know, even uh, it happens in a football. That even if you are better, or you know, and you lose a game, then the the feeling is not the same. What I have to say, and what I just uh, uh, said to to our players in the dressing room, uh, after everything what uh, what has happened in the last uh, two weeks, you know, and uh, all the things uh, going around, and uh, I have to say that I'm really proud. I'm really proud today, uh, seeing those boys coming out uh, with uh, so much passion. Uh, such a commitment, wanting to compete, wanting to play after everything what uh, has happened. We are so proud and I think that's the right way. And, uh, you know, even if you lose this kind of game, you have to stay positive, you have to stay uh, without regrets because the way we play today, we wanted to compete, we wanted to achieve points. For me as a coach, it's, uh, it's a great thing. I'm so happy to see them even now in, a, in the dressing room. So, you know, we have to continue like that. So uh, with these circumstances and everything, we have to go through a February now to uh, continue with the fixtures and uh, continue ha working hard, trying to achieve uh, more points and trying uh, to, to play uh, good and get some points towards the end. Yeah, you know, since we started, we were never uh, talking about uh, top four. And the circumstances and the situation that we are now, uh, we have that chance to be in top four. We must never forget that uh, last year we were the team second from bottom. You know, we are coming from far away. We have so many players uh, going through the great development phase, speaking about domestic players and the foreigners who are bringing something extra. And we are happy when we see that kind of progress. I think that, uh, let's say, till the uh, COVID outbreak in our camp, I think that we were the team who, uh, who was playing uh, one of the best football in the league. I think that we were the team who were playing with such a passion, such a great things and great moments, and we want to continue like that. You know, sometimes it happens that you lose games like today, where we were kind of better side. But you know, we we were trying hard, we were pushing hard. We got that uh, goal from uh, from a set piece. It was a great shot. But you know. We have no regrets, we are not uh, sad, we have to continue. Of course, when you lose points, there are things that you have to improve, there are things that you want to uh, uh, make better. There are now games in front of us, we have to go further on to prepare and uh, to stay positive in our way. Mentality, commitment, uh, passion, uh, let's say the, the friendship and the, the great energy that these boys they have among them in the, in the dressing room and on the pitch, seeing them so happy with a, with a smile, uh, playing with the passion, with that energy, wanting to, uh, to win every game, it makes me happy. Again, comparing with the previous maybe periods and previous years, so uh, 
uh, they know that we are doing a good job, they know that they are working so hard and we have to continue doing so. So it makes me happy when I see all these things, we have a great energy, we have a great atmosphere. Of course, when you uh, get in lockdown for 15 days, you know, it makes you a little bit uh, down, but anyway. Now we are outside, we have to continue working hard, we have to uh, avoid injuries. We are happy that today on a fitness level, after only a couple of trainings, we were better side than our opponent and uh, we have to continue building up because there are uh, eight more games for us. We have to go uh, further on to continue to try to get the points. Yeah, but there are many contenders and uh, we have to uh, admit there are many con uh, teams that they are, uh, let's say, uh, more favorites for, uh, for a top level than us. But again, we want to fight, we want to be there. Because at the moment when you are there, you want to achieve that. I think that we have a great mentality of our players who want to be there. Uh, we have winner's mentality. We want uh, to, to climb uh, high up the table. Our today's opponent is a quality team. They have a, let's say, a large group of players who can make difference. Uh, also when they're coming from a bench, they have a, that's a team who is playing constantly on a level of uh, AFC, uh, you know. So against those teams, we try to compete, we try to beat them, of course. Sometimes it's hard, sometimes we can get points, but anyway, uh, there are many teams that we, they will still fight for the title, uh, be in the top four. I hope that we will continue our quest getting points and be there. So, One more thing also, we would I would like personally to, uh, to say that I'm very grateful for all the messages and all the things that we were, were receiving in the last period from, uh, from our fans. It was a, such a, a heart moving, uh, so emotional for all these boys and uh, I want to tell that every game uh, when we come onto the pitch, we will fight for them. We'll fight for our fans, we'll fight for this club because everybody likes being here. So, thank you one, thanks a lot uh, once more and uh, hope that we will make you proud and happy uh, in, in the next period.